Hi everybody, today I will show you how to run ads on the Instagram account. So let's just begin. Okay, so if I want to run the ads on my Instagram account, so how can I do that? Uh, we can simply use the Meta Business Suite for that. It actually manages all of our business activities on the Facebook Messenger and the Instagram from a single place with the Meta Business Suite. Okay, so we can simply use that. So for that, first of all, you have to go inside your Facebook account and you have to use your Facebook page here. Okay, so that is actually my Facebook page. And from here, I will actually use the Meta Business Suite. So let's click here. And you just have to make sure that you must be the admin of your page. Okay, so as you can see here, we are inside the Meta Business Suite here. So I will actually click on my profile here. Okay, so from here, you will be able to see the business account. Okay, so I have to go my this business account here and I can also create a new business account if I wanted to. But let's just go with this business account right now. Okay, so in the settings, as you can see here, we have the accounts, we have the pages, uh, we have the Instagram account. So now let's just click on the Instagram accounts and let's just see, do we have any Instagram account connected with our Meta Business Suite? Okay, so as you can see here that no Instagram account is connected with this business account. So you can simply add the Instagram accounts from here as well. All you need to do, you have to claim the Instagram account here. So now let's just log in into our Instagram account from here. Click on the login button. Okay, so now let's just click on the not now because I don't want to save the information into the browser. Alright, so sometimes it takes the login for the two times. I don't know why, but it does take the login for the two times. So let's just give it again. Click on the login. And that is how you can connect your Instagram account with your business account in the Meta Business Suite. Alright, so now what we need to do, you can actually connect the multiple Instagram accounts here as well. Okay, so if you wanted to. But right now, I only want to connect a single account here. Now what we need to do, we have to go inside the Add Account Settings here. So let's click on the Add Account Settings. As you can see here, we are inside the Add Account Settings here. Okay, so now what we need to do, we actually have to go into the campaigns here so from here we can actually run the ads for our instagram account from here all right so as you can see here we have the three different campaigns here but i will create a new campaign so let's click on the create okay so from here you can actually choose the campaign object so we have the awareness uh, which shows the ad to the people who are the most likely to remember them and we have the traffic if you want to gain the traffic with the help of the campaign you can select the traffic as the campaign objective and we have the engagement which is actually good for the messenger instagram and the whatsapp so since we are doing the ads for the instagram so we will actually go with the engagement and we also have the leads so if you want to collect the lead for your business or the brand you can actually use this as a campaign objective and we have the a promotion okay so if you want to promote your app you can simply promote your app and we have the sales okay so right now we will actually go with the engagement here and as you can see here we can actually name our campaign here but which is optional okay so now let's click on the continue okay so now let me just change the name of the campaign my instagram my instagram campaign so that is the name of our campaign and special ad category. So if our ad is related to the credit, employment, housing or the social issues, uh, elections and the politics, something like that, we will actually uh, select the category from here. But right now, as we know that we don't have any specific category like that. So we'll simply skip this and we have this campaign detail. So in the campaign detail, we have the buying type. Uh, which is auction we have the campaign objective which we choose the engagement so let's see the more options here so in the more option you actually have the campaign spending limit so that is not added right now and we also have the a b testing and we have the advantage campaign budget and both are disabled right now so now let's click on the next okay so now we have the ad set name so i will simply change the name of the ad set here my instagram ad set and in the conversion we actually have the five different locations for the conversion which is the messaging app on the ad and the website app and the facebook page okay so this simply means that where i do want to drive my engagement okay so we have the ad type then uh, in the ad tab you can actually see that we have the sponsored message or the click to message 
so let's keep the click to message here and now we have the facebook page and we have the messaging apps which is the messenger instagram and the whatsapp right now we know that we don't want to run the ad on the facebook page we actually want to run it on the instagram and we have connected our instagram account to our facebook page but you will see here that we don't see any option of our instagram account on this campaign okay so sometimes even if you add your instagram account in the meta business suite uh, our campaign is still unable to connect it automatically i don't know why but it does happen so now we'll actually connect our instagram account again here okay click next okay so from here you actually need to log in again into your instagram account okay so click on the note now okay so now you can see here that now our instagram account is connected with our facebook page so from here i can simply target my instagram account so let's check on our instagram account and now i'll simply uncheck my messenger so it simply means we will be only targeting the instagram here okay so now you can see here we have the budget and the schedule so in the budget we have the daily budget we have the lifetime budget so if you want to choose the lifetime budget for your ad campaign you can simply choose or if you want to go with the daily budget it's simply up to you how do you want to carry your uh, campaign here and after that we have the audience okay so if you want to create the new audience you can simply create the new audience from here or if you want to use the saved audience that you have used earlier uh, use the saved audience from here but as you can see that i don't have any saved audience here so we will simply create the new audience here okay so after the audience as you can see that the location of the audience is uh, pakistan and the age is from the 18 to the 65 so i want to add in the age here and it would be under 30 all right so you can specify the gender here so i will actually go with the woman here if you want to target the woman product you will actually need to go with the a woman in the gender and as you can see that we have the audience so i can simply create the audience from here but right now i'll just skip this okay so we also have the detailed targeting so if you want to add the demographics interest and the behavior of your audience okay of the people you want to target you will simply uh, include this in the detailed targeting and you also have the languages option here Okay, so in the placement, we have the advanced plus placements and we have the manual placements. So right now, I will go with the manual placements here. Okay, so here you will see the option of the platforms that where I want to target my ad. Alright, so I just want to target my ad on the Instagram. So I will simply uncheck the Facebook here. Alright, okay, so we don't have this. Alright, so as you can see here, in the placement, we have the feeds, we have the Instagram feeds uh instagram explore instagram explore home and in the stories instagram stories and the instagram reels okay so these are the placements for our instagram ad here so i'll simply check all of these options except the instagram feed so let's uncheck these options all right so we also have the option for in a stream ad for the videos and the reels so right now let's just keep it like this okay so we are good here now what we need to do we have to click on the next here okay so now as you can see that we have the ad name we have the ad setup which is the create ad okay so in the format i will actually go with the single image or the video so in the ad creative i will actually add the image here so let's add the image and i can upload the image from here but if i have the image already we can simply go with those images okay so from here i will actually go with the image that i have already in my uh, media here so let's select this image and click on the next and I don't want to crop the image here, so let's click done here. Okay, so this image will be used for your ad on the Instagram feed. Okay, so as you can see here, you can add the primary text if you want to. You can add the headline, you can add the call to action, which is right now the same message. And we also have the other options to order now, apply a book, uh, contact us and etc. And you can see here that we have the message template here. So you can go with the existing templates or you can create your own template here and we have the tracking all right so now let's click on the publish and it will actually publish the ad on your instagram account all right so now you can see here that we have completely created the ad campaign for our instagram account with the help of meta business suite okay so this is how you can run your instagram ads with the help of meta business suite
Alright, so if you really find this video useful, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.